So what's happening YouTube? Today we're looking at the Yarbo S1 Pro. This is the first robot snow blower, mower and blower out there. Here we go. First things first, make sure to subscribe to my channel, hit that like button if you want to get one of these. I'll link this down below. There might be a promotion link there as well, so go ahead and check that out. For now, let's go ahead and unbox this and try this out. Here we go. So when buying a Yarbo, it comes with the universal body. It has the Snowblower S1, which is the modular snowblower attachment. It comes with the dock as well, the wireless charging dock and the battery. The Yarbo does provide all the tools you need. The instructions are super easy. Even if you didn't look at the instruction manual, it actually has stickers that tells you step by step from A to Z on how to install and assemble each one. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to do an in-depth instruction on this unboxing and everything because I did record every single step on how to put it together. So let me know in the comments below and I'll be able to do that video for you guys. Subscribe to the Yarbo YouTube channel because they actually have all the instructions on there and you don't have to really read, you can just watch it from their channel. Now, of course, the traditional way of snow blowing is you go outside, you take your snow blower, or maybe you only have a shovel. And what's gonna happen is you manually, you know, shovel and mow. But Yarbo takes that into the consideration that maybe you don't want to go out there because it's minus 40. It's too cold out there and it ends up that you get frostbite and people being out there for that long, 15 minutes or so, will get you frostbite. So Yarbo fixes that by creating a robot snowblower, which is the S1. And the best part about the Yarbo robot is that it's not just a snowblower because it is also modular. So you can use it as a blower or a, even a mower. Now this is the best when you have to go to work at like 5 a.m. or 6 a.m. You don't have to wake up extra early to get rid of snow. All you gotta do is hit start on the Yarbo and it'll do its job automatically. It also puts you away from being outside for too long. We work for 10 hours per day and then we have to be stuck out there for another hour or so so that we can get rid of snow. But with Yarbo, all you gotta do is hit one button on your phone and it'll work and you can spend all the time with your wife and your kids when you need that time. The Yarbo is super safe as well. It has three cameras, two on the, on the sides and one on the front. The best part about the Yarbo is that it actually detects people, animals, uh, walls or even trees so that it'll actually go around them and won't hit anything. It can detect up to five feet ahead and 16 feet on the side. The best thing about the Yarbo as well is that you don't have to plug it in manually. It has a wireless auto charging dock that they call it, which makes your Yarbo ready to work 24 seven. And all you gotta do, like I said, is hit one button. It'll start from that dock. It'll do its job and once it's done, it'll go back to the dock to start charging again. Now it uses AI as well for the precise snow throwing. This is the best part because you don't have to really figure out where the robot's gonna throw the snow. It detects the side of like your perimeter and that's how it shoots and it automatically understands that it's gonna shoot that way or it'll shoot the other way. It'll also measure how high it'll throw so that it'll throw further or higher. You can control the flexible snow shoot and it has an adjustable deflector angle from 18 degrees to 62 degrees. The shoot also rotates 180 degree. The best part about the shoot as well is that it can throw up to 40 feet of distance. That's amazing. Now, if your driveway is on a slope and there's an incline, the Yarbo can actually go up those lines 
even on wet snow, even when there's ice on the way. If it's struggling to go up the incline, there's an option to install spikes so that it'll be able to go up that incline. Now, when it is plowing the snow, it has a 20 inch cleaning width and a 12 inch intake height. The Yarbo Snow Blower S1 can clean one inch of snow over 6,000 square feet or handles five inches of snow over 2,000 square feet on a single charge. The best thing about this as well, I've seen it on the internet, they used it over water. It is IPX6 waterproof. You can also control it via remote control. They actually provide you an Xbox controller so that that is programmed to the Yarbo. So if you are outside and you want to manually control it, you'll be able to do that. You don't have to use the app because sometimes it's cold out there. You need gloves. You'll be able to just use the controller with the gloves on so you don't get cold. The Yarbo battery as well has a cold resistance and super high efficiency battery, which keeps it warm when it is cold out there and it keeps it cool when it is too hot out there. The other thing that I want to mention as well is that the Yarbo base and the s1 snowblower is actually pretty heavy so if it's trying to push snow you actually want it to be powerful and heavy so that it's able to like stand on its own and to prove that it's powerful they actually have the yarbo pull a car so it's able to push that much power from its motors which is really awesome the yarbo snowblower s1 is actually a two-stage design which is really good for all types of snow it has a smart route planning as well you do need to install an antenna so that the yarbo will know the precise location of your driveway and basically this is the first autonomous snow blower powered by ai so it's amazing that we are in this stage of everything is autonomous so that there's robots that will do jobs for us that we don't want to do so basically this is app powered so let's go ahead and scan the qr code and download the app we're gonna create an account as well and we're gonna connect the yarbo to our network with the app you'll be able to control the yarbo increase the power of the plow you can control the shoot up and down turn on lights as well and pretty much fully control your yarbo s1 so this is what I started with, with the snow. Um, we're already going to spring, so there's not a, a whole lot of snow. But by the end of it, I was able to actually clear out all the snow, even the wet snow here, as you could see. I'm pretty impressed with the Yarbo S1, and I'm looking forward to seeing more snow, actually, so that I can use it again because it's super fun. This makes uh, snow plowing super fun instead of a chore like before. Now, there is another option. If you don't want to you know, plow or maybe it's a wet snow, you can use a snow plower like this one. It's an attachment that you put in front of the snow blower. Super handy for snow or ice that got stuck on the driveway now if you're wondering if you can use this as night you will be able to because it has lights built into it and if it's a heavy snowstorm the cameras are also heated so it won't be filled with snow so the yarbo s1 snowblower is ready for anything at night or even a heavy snowstorm and that's it for today, everyone. Thanks for watching. I hope I was able to help you on your choice on a brand new Yarbo Snowblower S1. If you want to get one of these, I'll link this down below. So go ahead and check that out. There is going to be a promotion link out there. So go ahead and check that out as well. It does help out the channel a lot if you get it from there. Thanks for watching, everyone. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that like button. I was going to, I'm going to do more videos on this. I'm going to show you a full video of unboxing if you want that or even assembly. Just a full version, 20 minute long, whatever, how long it took me. I'm gonna, in, I'm gonna do multiple videos on this so that you guys can have uh, multiple test runs and you guys can see how it actually does. Um, hopefully, I will be able to have on hand the mower as well so that you guys can see that this can be a robot mower as well and a blower. Uh, I'm really excited to do all that. So, um, make sure to hit that notification bell so you can be notified when those videos come here. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.